telling you, you are not gonna believe what I fit in this bag. Or maybe you will. Hi my loves, thanks for returning. I hope this video finds you happy and doing well. As you know by the thumbnail, this video is going to be on the Michael Kors Blair Extra Small Duffel Bag. So if you're interested, then just keep watching. Okay, this is she, this is her, this is the cutest thing I've ever seen. Oh my God, isn't she cute? So this is an extra small bag, as you can see. Remember, I'm the girl that likes the bigger bags. Uh, I might go for a medium size, but this is so tiny. I thought she was so cute. Plus red is one of my favorite colors, right under black and pink. But I just had to show this to you all. Now, a couple of places are selling this. Well, there's more than a couple of places. You can get it on the Michael Kors website. I got this bag from TJ Maxx. Typically people are like, go to TJ Maxx, go to TJ Maxx, you'll see this. But in TJ Maxx, I never see any of the popular current styles that are at the boutique or even selling online. And when I saw this, had to grab it and it's cheap, like $79. And again, I see so many people always, you know, showing their stuff. Now it's probably just the one in my neighborhood. But before I get into everything that I was able to fit in this bag, this particular bag is a crossbody. It has gold tone hardware. The size is 7.5 width, the height is 5.5. 7.5 and the depth is 4 inches. It has adjustable straps 20.5 to 24.5. It has a handle drop of 3.75. It has an exterior pocket and it has an interior front pocket that zips and one that does not zip. So yeah, super, super duper cute. Um, all of this is pretty consistent with the other bags that I have by Michael Kors. Uh, this type of chain, it, it feels the same, not substantial. Um, all of the Michael Kors is imprinted on it, on the inside of the bag. It has that little tag uh, that has Michael Kors information, but it is so stinking cute this thing is okay so okay enough about that let's go ahead and let me show you everything that i fit in this bag because you're not you're not gonna believe what i have in this bag or, or maybe you will but anyway so let's go ahead and start so in the front pocket you can see that i have my clinics and everything this is stuffed to capacity so it may take a second to kind of get it out but i do have my clinic right here okay so i'm gonna go ahead and put that on the bed and I'm gonna go ahead and take off this strap so it won't make too much noise while I'm trying to get things out of the bag even though I still have this part hmm okay and it's still cute without the straps this is so stinking cute this is the cutest little stuff okay enough of that all right so let's open her up okay I've got my Tylenol pills and you all see this little glittery thing. I know you all are familiar with this, but those of you all who watched my Austin Pebble Leather bag review and what's in my bag, this little pouchy thing is like a catch all for emergency situations. And in here, it has like everything you could ever think of. It's got chapstick, um, it's got a fingernail file, it's got a band-aid, it's got a uh, breath spray, um, it's got a little mini sewing kit. It's got um, it's got fingernail polish remover. It's got nail polish in it. And of course, everything is like in a micro size, really, really tiny. Of course, it would have to be to be in this little bag. But I'm gonna link the video where I actually take out each item in this bag and show you. And that would be the review of the Michael Kors Austin bag. So. Yeah, I have this and anytime I carry a small bag, I just like to have it because it's literally got everything in it that you could possibly need. All right, so this is a bag and I think this would be great for those of you all who carry small bags and when you go out, you end up buying a lot of stuff. You don't wanna carry a big bag, but when you're out and you're buying stuff, you end up needing a bigger bag. I think this is something that all of you all would really love, but look at this. This is a bigger bag, okay? And it can also fit this bag. This bag right here can fit in this bag. And I know you say, I know you lying. <laughs> no, I'm not lying. So I'm gonna open it up and I'm gonna show you. 
I'm gonna show you how this Kareen, I think that's how you pronounce the name of this bag. I'm gonna show you how it can fit in this bag, okay? So look at that, it's totally in there, okay? So you've got this bag inside of your extra small bag. So if you're going shopping, like I said, and you're gonna be buying some things or you're going to the grocery store or wherever, okay? Get you one of these little foldable bags, fold it up and put it in your extra small bag and you'll be good to go. So I'm gonna put that right there. All right, so what's next in this purse? I've got some Clorox wipes. Here they are, these are on the go Clorox wipes. If you go out to dinner and you wanna clean the table yourself, make sure things are sterile or in your car or wherever, you know, these always come in handy. I think everybody probably has those. This is some uh, lip gloss or kind of like a, a, a lip moisturizer. This is by Juvia's Place. And the reason I, the reason I have it you know, standalone is because this is a mini bag. I can't carry my normal makeup bag that I would typically carry in a larger bag. So I got this right there, so I'm put that there. All right, so what's up next is a hand sanitizer, and this is just a hand sanitizer from Bath and Body Works. I think that everybody probably owns one of that or one of those. Next up, I have a mirror, okay, which is pretty classic. Every lady needs some kind of mirror, all right? Next up, I have my big old thing of gum and it fits right there. And I know you're like, girl, why do you carry that big old thing of gum? And this is it, okay? And this is the Ice Cubes Cherry Limeade and these are so delicious. I absolutely love them. So next up, I have my one of my wallets and this is it, this uh, matches the bag. And inside of this wallet, I keep my change. And this pretty much uh, took the place for this bag of the green coin purse that I have. And as you can see, I hope you can see that. I have my coins in here, so there you go. All right, and next up I have my phone. Okay, this is a Samsung Galaxy Note. Put that there. And next up is my wallet and this is it right here. And this was pretty much a shocker for me because it is the length of the purse. It did take a little bit maneuvering, but I was able to get it in there. And let me go ahead and get it out. Okay, and this is it. So as you can see, this is pretty much the length of the bag and it fits. All right, so inside of my wallet, I have my cards and my cash and my key to my car. I always keep that in the in this wallet. I just like to keep it in this wallet because it's something big. I don't even understand the method to my madness, but uh, this is the key. Um, I keep my cash in this outer slot and this outer pocket. And of course I have my cards and anything else. Okay. and that fits there. Now, typically I would have my glasses in my bag, but that would be in a bigger bag. And also a lot of times I wear my glasses around my neck. So that's why I didn't have it in there. But overall, I think that this beauty fit a lot of stuff. So stick around. I'm going to show you how this particular bag looks on my body type. I am 5'7 and a size 14. And yeah, you can let me know what you think. 